Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome to uh, T a Tom's TV review. As always, I am Tommy Johnson uh, with uh, Tom's TV review. And today I have my Memoriam um, Johnson Hot Dogs t shirt on. And that's because we are going to review a special episodes series called Johnson Bros Super Explosion Show. Now, many of you diehard fans of mine will uh, know that I reviewed the two, the two episodes, but however, there are uh, more that I have just realized. So, as as, ma as many as you know, that there are um, uh, this show is very close to me because my cousin actually uh, made the show. He is my actor, and he made the show. So, um, actually, there are only two episodes were released. But in reality, seven were made. This is because the last five, well, the, the show got canceled before the last five <coughs> could air. <coughs> so, but luckily, I have a, a, a little birdie who, who gave me the last episodes. So now today we are going to be reviewing the last five episodes and give my thoughts on them. Although legally, I cannot show them. So here are my thoughts on the last two episodes. <clears throat> or last uh, five episodes. Episode three was interesting because it was more of a documentary on why the Holocaust didn't happen. The female antagonist of episode four is, is one of the greatest I've ever seen. I mean, she her personality alone was absolutely astounding she carried the episode she her she, her arc in one episode in one 30 minute episode was absolutely amazing they were able to fit in such a dynamic and an interesting character in in one episode she came and gone in one episode and it was absolutely beautiful her acting really carried the performance she 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 knew her lines she was a method actor for i believe i believe she lost and gained 70 pounds for this so really amazing and I I'm actually astounded that this is the greatest person an actress an antagonist I've ever seen in in cinema or t TV in or either and it, it's really amazing to watch and I just couldn't believe it. I, I cried at the end when when she was gone it was it was hard for to, to stop watching the movie or the show so yeah, absolutely beautiful. I loved every second of it. Nice tits too. They, they, they took the storyline of 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 everything that happened before, and they they kind of gathered it up, and they threw it out. The petting zoo massacre of episode five was really interesting and wonderfully shot, and it it was a it was a big bold move. On the uh, cinematographers and the directors and the TV makers, filmmakers of this episode, because it's we live in a culture now where everything is so sensitive and careful, and everybody's so careful about what they do. You put the little plastic edges on every corner of the t the table so the babies don't hit the head. But it was it was really refreshing to see a filmmaker completely ignore that and 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 go a new way just for the sake of storytelling and it was it was wonderfully shot and, and amazing I loved it loved every second of it it was it was nice to say the least it was nice it was nice um, however I was confused about the gay sex scene which followed the show the series is cool because almost none of the episodes uh, correspond with each other um, uh, except for the beginning two uh, it's much like that show uh, Black Mirror uh, except this show has many more messages of uh, racism. In the seventh episode of the the season, the season finale, um, the the main protagonist, my cousin, is having breakfast with his wife, and he's telling her how how much he loves her and how much he appreciates her. And how happy he is that she's there and how happy he is that they survived the uh, the Nagasaki bomb from the episode earlier, and um, it was it was nice, and then after he was done talking, she kind of sat there confused, 
And um, she kind of whispered to him, uh, what's my line? Which I thought was cool. And then um, it was really interesting to me when he turned straight to the camera and said, turn the camera off. And then he began to physically abuse his wife. This series is interesting. It's interesting to see in this series when uh, that you could see the opportunity for special effects. But they kind of just say, fuck it. We're going to do it ourselves. And they, it comes out really... Um, different okay everybody that was my uh, review for the Johnson Bros super explosion show from the company Johnson hot darts and um, I'll keep you updated from anything I know about that company all I know is that they seem kind of desperate for attention right now so there seems to be willing to do whatever they want <laughs> uh, it's a shithole over there but uh, yeah so um, I, I heard some rumors actually from uh, around the the family table, uh, saying that they were gonna try to to bring someone back for to to raise the stakes again. <laughs> I mean, they killed off Gary, so I mean, it's it's not like it'd be stupid for them to bring him back because he he shot himself with a shotgun. I mean, he's de he's dead, he's dead. It would be it would be stupid, retarded for them to bring him back from the dead. You know, show him again. He's done, right? So it'd be stupid. It'd be stupid. <laughs> 